नमस्कार दिस इज निर्जा एंड यू आर लिस्निंग टू ट्रेवल वर्ल्ड ऑनलाइन न्यूज हाईलाइट ऑफ द डे एच के टी बी टू होस्ट थ्री सिटी ट्रेवल मिशन इन इंडिया फर्स्ट एवर ग्रेट एस्केप इवेंट टेक्स नॉर्थ ईस्ट इंडिया बाई स्टोम गो आर ऑल सेट टू वेलकम टूरिस्ट फ्रॉम मल्टीपल मार्केट्स एम्स्टरडैम वेनिस बाली चूज एनवायरमेंट ओवर टूरिज्म रिजन सेवन सीज क्रूजेज इंट्रोड्यूसेज न्यू एंड एक्सक्लूसिव स्पा ट्रीटमेंट Club Mahindra Partners IDA to offer special privileges on membership. Now, news and details. The Hong Kong Tourism Board (HKTB) will host its travel mission in India after a pause of 3 years. The annual marquee event will include a delegation of 28 trade members comprising Hong Kong land operators, hoteliers, airlines, cruise companies and popular family attractions like Ocean Park Hong Kong. Hong Kong Disneyland, Madam Tussauds Hong Kong, Nagong Ping 360, Legoland Discovery Center Hong Kong, among others. The Hong Kong delegation will hold business sessions with the Indian trade partners in Bangalore, Tuesday, 22nd August, Mumbai, Wednesday, 23rd August, and New Delhi, Friday, 25th August. The trade mission will focus on the growing leisure, fly cruise and meetings and incentive Amandai segment. highlighting the diverse experiences in hong kong for indian travelers leveraging the 14 day visa free travel facility for indian passport holders and flight capacity expansion from indian cities in a historic event that marked a significant milestone for the local economy and tourism the picturesque town of nalan in mizoram played host to the first ever great escape festival in the northeastern region of india Organized by the Nalan Grape Farming and Processing Cooperative Society in collaboration with the Ministry of Tourism, Government of India, North East, the Grape Escape brought together wine enthusiasts, tourists, and dignitaries for a celebration of the thriving winemaking industry in the heart of Mizoram. Nestled amidst rolling hills and verdant landscapes, the Nalan Winery stood as the centerpiece of the event. Already renowned as the most prominent winery in Mizoram, the Hnalan Winery has become a beacon of economic development, providing livelihoods to over 200 families in the region. The winery's flagship product, the fine red wine Isabella, has rapidly gained recognition for its exquisite taste and texture, with an impressive daily production of around 500 bottles. Distinguished figures from various fields graced the event with their presence. Notable attendees included Anil Oro, Regional Director, North East of the Ministry of Tourism, Dr. Zeda Thimsanga, MLA Champai North, DC Champai, the President of the All India Wine Producers Association, and a brigadier from the Assam Rifles. Their collective presence underscored the event's importance in boosting local industry and promoting regional tourism. During the event, Anil Oro spoke enthusiastically about the transformative potential of the Great Escape event for the Champai region. He announced that under the SD2 initiative, Champai would be developed as a hotspot for wine, adventure, and border tourism. This announcement was met with enthusiasm from local stakeholders and attendees who recognized the incredible opportunities that such development could bring to the area. The president of the Wine Growers Association also expressed optimism about the future of Kampai's tourism industry, highlighting the untapped potential that the region possesses. The convergence of wine production, adventure tourism, and its unique border location opens up a plethora of possibilities that could draw visitors from far and wide. In a bid to combine sport and festivity, The Grape Escape event featured a marathon race that saw enthusiastic participation from both boys and girls. This addition not only added an element of excitement to the event but also highlighted the importance of a healthy and active lifestyle. Members of the Yuva Tourism Club, along with local wine growers and farmers, turned up in large numbers, creating an atmosphere of camaraderie and celebration. The Grape Escape event not only showcased the region's winemaking prowess but also highlighted the potential for synergizing agriculture, tourism, and local culture for the betterment of the community. 
As the new tourism season approaches, Goa is gearing up to welcome charter tourists from Moscow on 1st October. The roster includes charters from Russia, the UK, Kazakhstan, and Israel. Although last season's attempts to engage with Israeli tour operators yielded no results, there is confidence this season will fare better. In the past, Goa experienced a golden period of charter tourism between 2012 to 2013 and 2018 to 2019 when footfall consistently surpassed 2.5 lakh tourists annually. Despite challenges posed by the pandemic in recent seasons, Goa excelled domestically while foreign footfalls remained low. The upcoming season serves as a litmus test for both the trade and tourism department's strategies. The tourism industry has high hopes for the fit segment's growth, especially with the inauguration of the Manohar International Airport at Mopa. Amsterdam joins Venice as the latest destination to consider restricting tourist levels through bans on cruise ships in its city centers. While the plan has been approved by the city council, the changes have yet to be enacted. Still, the measure is a sign of how cities are balancing tourism and environmental concerns. The polluting cruise is not in line with Amsterdam's sustainable ambitions, Ilana Ruderkirk of the D66 party, which introduced a motion to close the city's central cruise ship terminal, told Bloomberg. Cruise ships in the city center also do not fit in with the task of combating mass tourism. Amsterdam has one of Europe's biggest cruise ports, and the city receives more than 1 million tourists in an average month, exceeding its population of 800,000. On top of this, one big cruise ship can produce the same levels of nitrogen oxides in one day as 30,000 trucks, according to independent research and consultancy business CE Delft. As more cities and regions try to find ways to curb visitor numbers, this must be balanced with the economic reality that tourism is an industry that makes up around 10% of global GDP. One in five new jobs created worldwide in 2014 to 2019 was in the travel and tourism sector, the World Travel and Tourism Council says. When COVID-19 halted global travel, Revenues fell 80% for some subsectors of the tourism industry in the EU, affecting 11 million jobs. As tourism bounces back from the pandemic, policymakers are trying to find ways to do it more sustainably and get tourists to foot some of the bills through ecotourism taxes. Region 7 Seas Cruises, the world's leading luxury ocean cruise line, has revealed new and exclusive spa treatments that will debut on board Seven Seas Grandeur, setting sail in November 2023. The ship's serene spa and wellness experience will enhance relaxation at sea with an indulgent treatment menu that integrates best-in-class techniques and luxury ingredients from around the world, including new treatments utilizing the restorative power of an umber and quartz crystal bed, and an advanced treatment table for a zero-gravity wellness massage. In addition, a new treatment, the Tahitia Hydration Ritual, has been created exclusively for those staying in the palatial, 4,443-square-foot Regent Suite, which can be enjoyed in the Suite's very own private spa. Regent also revealed new details about the ship's serene spa and wellness features and design, including a new relaxation room. We are thrilled to expand our serene spa and wellness offerings exclusively for our valued guests on board Seven Seas Grandeur, said Andrea DiMarco, president of Regent Seven Seas Cruises. Not only can guests enjoy the relaxation of serene spa and wellness services already found across the world's most luxurious fleet, but they can now be pampered with new, innovative treatments, making their unrivaled experience even more lavish and indulgent. Exclusively for Seven Seas Grandeur's Serene Spa and Wellness, two groundbreaking treatments harness the power of a pioneering umber and quartz crystal bed. Guests seeking complete rejuvenation can book a hot mineral body boost to alleviate muscular pain and remove toxins by stimulating every cell in the body, while the poultice-powered muscle release works away so aching muscles with an invigorating treatment that targets tension areas with vibrational energy, finishing with a restorative facial massage. 
a nourishing umber balm used in the hot mineral body boost and the unique eucalyptus juniper umber and quartz poultice utilized in the poultice powered muscle release works with the extraordinary umber and quartz crystal bed energizing tired bodies and elasticizing the skin for a completely unique experience the zero gravity wellness massage is the next generation of innovative wellness producing a zero gravity effect the body is suspended on an advanced treatment table that allows for ergonomic workflows and a seamless series of sophisticated techniques eight table positions enable effective and precise reach of every muscle group in a choreographed massage focusing on the back and main muscles to release tension and improve body mechanics All three new treatments on board 7C's Grandeur are 75 minutes long and priced at 299 US dollar per guest. For the ultimate in Swiss spa experience, guests staying in the most exclusive address at sea, the Regent Suite, will have access to a lavish new treatment. The Tahitia Hydration Ritual is a 75 minute treatment that transports guests to the South Pacific. Warmed monoi oil infuses frangipani flowers with pure coconut oil and melts into the skin during the body wrap treatment. Elevating the standard of relaxing ambience, Seven Seas Grandios Regent Suite features an impeccably designed master bathroom complete with personal sauna, steam room, treatment area and unlimited complimentary treatments. Emphasizing the unrivaled experience Regent is known for, Serene Spa and Wellness found on board all five, soon to be six, Regent ships, is a holistic journey of health and well-being that extends beyond the physical spa, with fitness classes, nutritious and delicious cuisine selections, plus wellness-themed shore excursions. Fitness experts at Fitness by Serene Spa and Wellness lead popular exercise classes such as Pilates, yoga and meditation and are available to offer advice and demonstrate the use of fitness equipment. Equipment includes spinning bikes, dumbbells, treadmills, Technogym strength machines, workout mats and step benches and one-on-one training. Guests may savor the best of world cuisine with Serene Spa and Wellness selections in many restaurants on board. These culinary dishes offer an extensive array of innovative options that inspire healthy living, featuring exquisite dishes influenced by a myriad of global fares including delectable plant-based cuisine. On land, Serene Spa and Wellness tours enhance wellness through immersive and restorative shore excursions where guests can For example, soak in mineral-rich thermal springs in Rome, Italy, or balance themselves in a yoga class overlooking the picturesque seaside town of Taormina, Sicily. Club Mahindra, the flagship brand of Mahindra Holidays and Resorts India Limited, has partnered with the Indian Dental Association (IDA) to provide IDA members with exciting benefits and special privileges on Club Mahindra memberships. This collaboration aims to extend well-deserved relaxation and family bonding opportunities to dental professionals who tirelessly dedicate themselves to the oral health and well-being of others. Club Mahindra, India's leading vacation ownership company, offers 125 plus resorts across India and abroad with 2000 plus unique experiences. The resorts provide happy family experiences and believe in the credo of making every moment magical. Club Mahindra's commitment to offering exceptional holiday experiences makes it an ideal partner for IDA, enabling dental professionals and their families to unwind and rejuvenate. The demanding nature of the dental profession often subjects professionals to long working hours and significant stress throughout the year. Recognizing the need for these diligent individuals to take a well-deserved break, Club Mahindra presents an array of offerings that cater to the diverse interests of every family member. The exclusive benefits extended to IDA members as part of this collaboration include special discounts and freebies on Club Mahindra vacation packages. Members can now plan their dream vacations with ease, taking advantage of the exclusive privileges tailored specifically for dental professionals. That's all in bulletin. For the latest updates, keep listening to Travel World Online Radio with you always. Kabhi bhi, kahi bhi.